hearing. Hearing is a complex four-stage process. Your ears are responsible for stage one. Stage two happens in the brainstem. And finally, stage three and stage four take place in the auditory cortex involving other senses and brain areas. Sensing happens at stage one, where your ears, actually your hearing organs, sensing all the sounds surrounding you all the time. They convert and encode all components of these sounds accurately into electrical impulses, up to 36 million of them per second, and transmit these impulses to the brainstem. Analyzing happens at stage two, where the brainstem receives the electrical impulses from both ears. It analyzes them to provide feedback to regulate cochlear and middle ear functions and scan for spectral similarities, level and time differences to provide the basis of directional hearing. Perception happens at stage three, where the auditory cortex at first arranges the millions of incoming electrical impulses into patterns, so-called oral activity images, containing all the acoustic information such as loudness, pitch, timbre, and localization. Comprehension happens at stage four, where you comprehend the meaning encoded within these electrical impulse patterns. Comprehension happens by comparing the input to patterns in your auditory memory. If a match with assigned meaning is found, you comprehend automatically, instantaneously and effortlessly. If this pattern is unknown, you assign meaning and save it to your auditory memory. These processes are initiated by a hearing sensation, but work with significant input from other senses and brain areas. Sensing is an innate process that you cannot train or otherwise actively influence or improve. Analyzing, perceiving, and comprehending are innate abilities that need high-quality input to develop and maintain. You gradually develop these abilities in early childhood and throughout your youth. To maintain this ability, you need continuing high-quality auditory stimulation throughout your life.